Today I'm making a bacon and eggs breakfast. To start, I'm gonna make some bacon. I took two strips of thick cut bacon and cut those in half. And I started with a cold pan and now I'm just going to cook these over a medium heat until they are cooked through and golden brown and crispy. I'm going to be making sunny side up eggs to go along with this. You can do scrambled or over medium or well. So in a preheated pan over a low heat, I've added around two tablespoons of oil and now I'm just going to add two large eggs. And I'm going to cook these over a low heat until the whites are done and the yolks are runny. Now that my eggs and bacon are done, I'm going to make some toast. So into my toaster, I'm adding two slices of white bread. I don't think you guys need instruction on how to make toast, but if you burn it, try again. <laughs> To go along with this breakfast, I'm making a Greek yogurt with granola. So here I just have a small container of plain Greek yogurt. I'm going to give it a mix and add it to a bowl. Now I'm going to add maple syrup to taste. So if you don't have maple syrup, you could also use honey. And just add your favorite granola. The one I'm using today is a pumpkin spice blend. It also has pumpkin seeds in the mix. It's really good. And that's it. This breakfast is done. In the mornings, my husband does like to make breakfast for everybody because he gets up early, but today I knew he had a meeting this morning and I'm trying to get him breakfast before his online conference. And so I'm going to take this to his office. So I decided to make a quick Korean coffee. This is an instant coffee, and this particular one doesn't have sugar in it, which my husband likes. If you're interested in it, I will put a link below if I can find one, but this does make it convenient when he's trying to have coffee on the go. I hope you give this recipe a try. I hope you like it and thanks for watching.